Hello everyone, I'm Soylent Will and welcome back to Let's Play Fallout 2. And let's go check out the Rawhide Saloon. See who there is to talk to. Did you hear the one about... What's your sign? I don't know. If you're looking for work, stranger, go down to the sto Stockman's. Okay. If you're looking for work? Good. Who are you? Why, bother Why are you bothering Lenny, you little white grub? Hey, I've got a Lenny. Well, I guess there's one person to talk to. Mira is the name. What do you have, stranger? Um, information. You going to buy a drink? Ten dollars. Sure. So that it, stranger? Got a little time for some questions? Sure, I got some time. That's what bartenders are supposed to do. Just don't get no ideas. Let's see. Tell me about this town. Name's NCR. Used to be Shady Sands. But after the Master's defeat, Eridesh and the others founded the Republic. Now NCR sits right on the border. Everything south here's Republic ruled. Hmm. A few more questions. Let's see. Well, actually, what, what does the hmm do? Word of advice. Keep your nose clean in town. Courts aren't too friendly to our types, if you know what I mean. Citizens got more rights than you. Hmm. Look, that's all I got to say about that. Okay. A few more questions. I'm glad I went through that. Ever hear of Vault 13? Yeah, another one of them wackos looking for lost treasure. You ought to go see Salt Beef Bob over at Weston's Ranch. He's always talking about treasure. You may have to wet his whistle, though. A few more questions. I'm looking for a thing called a geck. Know anything about it? You tell me how to mix it, and I'll pour it for you. Okay. It's not a drink. It's the Garden of Eden creation kit. Garden of Eden creation kit sounds technical. You might want to try looking up Dorothy, the city engineer. A few more questions. Well, let's see if you will barter. Do you just have drinks on you? You have 10. Is that literally the $10 I just gave you? Fantastic. You do have stim packs. What do you charge for them? Yeah, that's about right. Is this worth 10? How about that? We'll just... We'll just undo our transaction. How about that? Could have just hit all and been done. But I don't know. Sometimes I feel clicky, I guess. Yeah, I'll take... You can have your drink back. I'd rather have $10. Thank you. That was a good trade. Well, that kills the idea, I guess, is the way that I end that conversation. What's going on in here? These didn't talk, right? Nope, nope. These people are not talking. Okay. We'll walk around here. Anything to search? Didn't look like it. And you didn't really barter or anything. What's it, this town? Well, let's check the bulletin board here, right? Welcome to the New California Republic. Before entering our fair city, please take a moment to familiarize yourself with the following rules and regulations. No weapons may be openly carried in the city limits. Obeying the law is good citizenship. Back. Persons found under the influence of alcohol or chems will be arrested. Good, there won't be any drunks or junkies pestering you for fixed money. Back. Slavery, gambling, and prostitution are not permitted within city limits. Looks like they're trying to create a respectable, decent community to live in. All right. And ignorance of the law is no excuse. A dumbass will get his butt kicked just as fast as a smartass. Equality before the law is a good thing. Okay. If you can't live by these laws, then get the hell out. It's a little blunt, but it does get the point across. I've read enough of this, I guess. What's in here? I don't see a sign or anything. So is it like a house? Ooh, who are you? Just keep your nose clean and we'll get along just fine, stranger. I haven't set up my quick save, so I should probably do that. That way it helps me keep my nose clean. Or when I get it dirty, I guess. Right? Yep, that's what I figured. I can't tamper with stuff. Okay, okay. What is this? Oh, well, I guess this isn't city limits. So... Is this jail or slavery? I'm not certain. A mix of both? Perhaps. Ooh. Wise old sage? Junk for sale, junk for sale. Look it over. Make me an offer. So what's for sale? Junk? I already have junk. Can't I use my junk to fix... <laughs> that the sense, Sonny. But yeah. What do you even charge for it? $49? I don't know. I don't know. I think I already have junk and it should work. I just have to go and get it for the purifier or something, right? 
And you don't have anything else I'm terribly interested in. So we'll go back to talking. Uh, I got five bucks. You got any good gossip? Heard, I heard tell there's a doc here in town says he's got some miracle cure. I ain't taking it though. Oh, okay. Does he now have the five dollars? Yes, he does. I love it. I love this game. It's so great. Okay, now goodbye. I think that's about all the info I want from you. Okay, this is I Vortis Hollowing Center. Holding Center? Talk to Vortis. Okay. I guess I gotta open the door. I can't just walk in. Those aren't interactable, right? I can just look at the Nuka Cola machine. All right. Well, is there anybody who will talk to me in here? Uh, what do you want? What is this place? What are you, a chump? Blind? What are you, chump? Blind? This is a slave pen. You want no more? Talk to Vortis. Okay. Uh, uh. So there's no slavery, but some like right outdoors, out their like front door here. So what do you want? Just got some questions. Well, I'm looking for Vault 13. Vault 13, get out of here. Damn place is a myth. Vault turn 13, my ass. Another question? Fuck you, boys. Escort <laughs> this annoying crud out of my sight. Bite me. Okay. I guess... Slavery is somewhat tolerated, it appears. All right, well, what's... We already searched that house, right? You see a thin-looking punk. That's fine transport, man. Truly fine. Oh, man, am I the one for you? Watch your car. Keep it safe. I don't have my car with me. What is this place? This is the NCR. High, mighty, righteous, absolutely, and always correct New California Republic. They are the ones who lead the people like us out of the wasteland into new and perfect future. Can you dig it? Um, will you barter with me? You've got fruit and thirty dollars. I don't have anything I really want to sell you, so just curious what you had to sell. Yeah, thanks. Goodbye. Yeah, there's no car here. I didn't bring my car. But it's funny because the game triggers that like I own the car, so it's probably Do you have anything to say? Good work for that caravan. Here's your two hundred dollars. Oh, I didn't get paid yet. That was stupid of me. Do I get a caravan back? Oh, I probably got to go back by myself now, huh? I kind of want to go back to Broken Hills and finish their stuff so I can get Marcus. So we're going to quick save and we're going to give that a shot. Fall 15, though. We've got that on our map. We're right here. I think we should go check out Vault 15 if we can. Let's see. I have a quick save. Maybe we'll be wusses and put down another quick save halfway there. We all are fully healed, right? I am. Yeah, and it doesn't say party, so. We got a quick save them halfway through now. Now we can go to the Vault 15. Let's check it out. I mean, like, we're right here, right? <clears throat> well, this is less than fortunate. I mean, it would be experience, but they don't drop loot, so. I get to do this, though. Punch him in the eyes. Let's see, 12 hit points. Not that great. Oh, that killed him. It was 11 still. Not not the greatest. And my turn. Nobody shoot me. Oh! You know, you're my favorite, Sulik. You are my absolute favorite. You made this infinitely scarier than it needed to be. You shot Vic, too, didn't you? Okay, punch this one in the eyes. It's dead. Can I punch this one? Yes. It's dead. And move out of Sulik's way. Oh, Christ, don't kill Vic. Okay. I was going to say this is going well, but it's, it's, it's definitely not. And move away again. I don't want to get shot. That didn't kill it. Come on, guys. You're not you're not helping a whole lot. Leaving me to do the killing. Okay, you should get punched in the eyes. I missed, of course. 95%. I mean, it's like rolling a one, I guess, right? 
on a D20. And my turn, I'm almost dead. But there's just one of them left, right? How many would it take to get where I could punch him? Quite a few. So let's move adjacent to him. Face that way and take your turn. Now we should be able to get up there and kill him if needed be. And we've got just enough for two targeted shots. There we go. And combat. Oh dear. Well, let's actually try what is first aid. We've got 8%. Failed to do any healing. So what is that? Is that five? Yes. Try to heal yourself. Three hit points. Yay. It's 25 XP. I think I can do it three times a day. And then I'll just rest off the rest. So let's do it one more time. Come on. One more time. There we go. And I'm up to 23. So now we're just going to... Oops. That's not what I want. Just go to Zed. Rest until party is healed. I mean, that was an extra 75 XP. You know, might as well use a little of the first aid, I guess, right? That certainly hurt me a lot more than it needed to. Thank you, Sulik. Okay. Oh, the party's still not healed. Vic, I guess, took some damage. Wow. He's just got a really slow healing factor, it looks like. Come on now. Or is it Lenny? Because he has so many hit points, he's just taking forever to refill them. I have no idea. This is an extraordinarily long time to just sit here. I'm not going to lie. I don't think I can. I, yeah, I can cancel it. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm full. The rest of you can heal while we travel, in my opinion. Let's go ahead and get a quick save down. And we're almost to Vault 15. Alright. Let's go ahead and put our weapons away. What do you say, fellas? Talk about your gear? Actually, I guess there's nothing to talk about. I guess he doesn't have his weapon out. That's it for now. Vic definitely does. So does Sulik. Talk about your gear. You got it. Put your weapon away. That's it for now. Talk to you about your gear. Put your weapon away. That's it for now. All right. None of us are armed. Let's go talk to people. Sorry, stranger. I don't have time to chat with you. All right. See you. I mean, I'm not going to force the issue. Oh, my. I'm sorry, but I have nothing to say to you. Please go away. Well, I mean, that's blunt, but to the point. Kind of what blunt means, but either way, redundancy, redundant apartment or something. Hi, I'm Rebecca. Can we talk privately, please? Um, sure. Where can we go for privacy? Thanks. We can go to my tent. Okay. We should be able to talk here. I have some questions for you first. What do you want to know? Um, what's going on around here? We call this place the squat because it's settled by homeless of many cities, but it's not much, but we, it's all we have to the West city. There's a city called the NCR. They've known about us for quite some time and never offered us any kind of help or hindrance. Now they're suddenly claiming this area has ancest as their ancestral home and they want it back. They keep sending people here to try and talk us out of our home, but they don't understand that we have nowhere else to go. We don't have the skills necessary to survive on our own if we leave here. What is, what is here that they want so badly? Well, there's a vault here. I think it's number 15. They want it to loot they want to loot it for any of the old technology that might still be there. That explains a lot. You've been very helpful. I need to ask you some more questions though. I'm looking for Vault 13. Do you know anything about it? <clears throat> I'm sorry, I have no idea. I would ask it about it in NCR. They have great interest in vaults lately. Alright. What do you want to know? Let's see. Who's in charge around here? 
That would be Zeke. He runs everything up here. You can find him at the building over there, points northeast. Thank you. I need to ask some more questions. Tell me about the vault. Well, we're not supposed to talk about it, but since I need your help, the vault is being repaired by Darian. He's our benefactor. It, when it's fully functional, we're all supposed to move in where we'll be safe from raiders, slavers, and the such. So far, he has the food and water systems up, but that's about it. You know, it's kind of funny they, that they managed to get something that complex fixed, but not the lights. The damn place is lit by torches. Anyway, Darian doesn't want anyone to know what's going on with the vault. He's afraid that someone will take it away from us if they find out. So we're told to drive off anyone who shows up here, especially the NCR. I need to know more. What do you need? So tell me about Darian. There's not much to say, really. Darian keeps to himself and never leaves the vault. If he and has anything to say, he says it through Zeke. I've only met him once, and he seemed like a nice guy. Let's see. I see. What do you want to know? Thanks, Rebecca. Let's talk about your problem now. I have a daughter named Chrissy who's a bit of a tomboy. She likes to run around, explore, and pretty much stick her nose into things. Chrissy's a good kid, though. She doesn't cause trouble. Oops. Where was I? She doesn't cause trouble. She's always home on time, and she's shown herself to be a very responsible young lady. I let her do as she pleases most of the time. Last week, Chrissy didn't come home. I've asked around, and nobody's seen or heard from her. I tried to find her myself, but Zeke, he's sort of the mayor here, stopped me. He said it wasn't safe for me to go out looking for on my own. He'd have some of, us men, some of his men do it. They couldn't find her either. He, and said that maybe the slavers got her. I can't explain why, but I don't believe the slavers took her. I have an uneasy feeling that something else is going on. And then there's this feeling that I'm being followed. I've had it ever since I talked to Zeke about Chrissy. I need someone to help me find my daughter. Will you help me, please? Let's see. All right, Becca, I'll try to help you. Thank you so much. I'll never be able to repay you for this. I'll wait here until you bring... Hey, there was some... One outside listening to us. I just saw their shadow on the tent wall. They just ran away. Points to, I'm sorry, points to the northeast. They must have heard everything. Let's see. They won't stop me from finding your daughter. All right. Do you have anything to loot? You just got two beds for you and your daughter? Fantastic. I mean, a tent, at least you're not exposed to the elements, I guess. When you sleep. Somewhat. I'm assuming there's like a flap that closes the door when you go to sleep. Either way. What's going on up here? Hi, I'm Dahlia. What can I help you with? Did you see someone go by here in a hurry? I see people go by here every day. I really don't pay much attention to them. Uh, look, a young girl's life is at stake here. The daughter of a worried mother. Can you please help me out? I don't give a rad rat's ass. I'm sorry. I'm just a gun who was hired to stand here and guard this trail. Other than that, I don't know what's going on around here. Oops. I had a daughter once, though. And yeah, some guy went by here. And I let him through because he knew the proper sign. Just like the sign you gave me. Go on. I'm out of here. Thanks. I won't forget this, Dahlia. I don't know what she did. She just went away so I could check the trail should I check the trail first am I gonna get in trouble for talking to this guy I should shoot you dead but I'm kind of curious about what you could possibly have to say to me I'm looking for a missing girl seen her you mean the one locked up in the back that we've been having fun with no I haven't seen her what hand over the girl and we can all leave here alive why in the hell would I do that it's good for your eternal soul because it's the worst thing because I'm the worst thing that could ever fear you could ever fear happening to you hand her over or feel the pain perhaps that sounds like a challenge I'll take it okay well that's I was hoping it was a speech resolution and my good speech would help but now I'm going to punch you in the eyes Twice. Trying to cripple my depth perception, huh? I was just trying to hit you, honestly. 
And I guess I'll move away a couple. A little bit out of the line of sight. Did I never give... I, I don't have his gun, so I'm assuming I gave him his gun back. Maybe I just never told him to use it, and now he just wants to punch people? I don't know. Lenny's not the smartest chap. That's for sure. Oh, there he goes. Yeah, he's got it. Good job, Lenny. Okay, so now who am I going after? It's that one and that one. I guess I'll run over here to help Vic and Lenny. And I've got five left, so I guess... I mean, I could do the kick, but I feel like this is stronger than the kick, probably. Let's punch him in the eyes. Killed him. Perfect. And I'll just take my turn. Wait, no, actually... Let's step up here a little bit, just to get out of line of sight. Because this should actually be a good distance for Vic. Sulik was hit for 30 points. What gun does she have? Oh my goodness. I guess I need to start charging in. She was hit for 47. Good job, Sulik. Oh, she's dead. Perfect. Can we end combat or are there more? Oh, that sounds like a save to me. Let's rob these people. What do you got? A sniper rifle. Vic can have that. That's nice. Let's go and check this guy out. A key? Okay. The Vault 15 Shack Key. Oh, and there's Spike Knuckles I just bought. Oh, well, I can sell them. I had Spike Knuckles for this fight then. All right? There was just three people, wasn't it? And I looted them all? Where's... Yeah. Or is, I only see two bodies. Am I crazy? Did we only kill two people? Is this the this is this the door that's locked? Ow! They set off a trap. Okay. Appears to be locked. That's fine. Oops. I don't want that. I want to just go drop down. Use something from my inventory. Use that key. Okay. That wasn't the door I was trying to use it on. Door appears to be locked. Okay, well, let's try it this way. Maybe maybe it's really wanting this. Use this on that. You unlock the door. Use this on that. You definitely locked the door. Oh, I had it already unlocked it. Okay, now let's open the door. I'm good at stuff, you know? If, you try, if you're here to try to rape me, you're going to be wearing your balls as a bow tie. Get it? I'd like to know who you are and what's going on here. In a nutshell, my name's Chrissy, and I'm from the squat. I was just out exploring last week when I found that entrance out here. I thought it might be an abandoned mine or something, so I decided to check it out. Well, it's not a mine. It's a secret entrance to Vault 15. The vault is being used as a base for a band of raiders called the Khans. They caught me snooping around, and their leader, Darian, had me locked up in here. People of the squad are protecting these guys by helping them keep the vault secret, but they don't know what's going, really going on here. Darian told us that the vault was being repaired so we could have a safe place to live with lots of food and water, but it's all a lie. I've been in there and looked around. The vault is dead and the food and water machines don't work. Our food and water has been coming from spoils of raids against caravans. More. Look, I've got to go home and warn everybody about what's really going on here. We can't help these monsters. Will you take me home? All right, I'll take you home. Really? Awesome. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> she, 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 she just goes. Okay. I'll come back and explore this in a second here, but let's, let's, let's finish up this mission here. Was it her? No, that's just a squatter. Was it this tent we were in? Yes. There we are. Talk to her. You saved my daughter. I can never repay you for your kindness. Thank you. Please wait here. I'll need to talk to Chrissy, and then we'll. And then I'd like to talk to you. Okay. My daughter has told me everything. I find it hard to believe that Darian is such a monster after all he's been doing for us, and to think we've been helping him hide his operations as a raider. I can guarantee you we won't stand for it any longer. I've already talked to Zeke, and he wants to see you. You should go see him now. Thank you. I got a lot. I got a level! I got a level! That's that's a quick save. That's a quick save. Alright. We're gonna level up, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go to our character. 
We are level 10. We're two levels away from our next perk. All right. Let's see. Unarmed. Get to 150 at least, right? Speech. I think I should start putting points into something. Oh, almost. Maybe I could also start doing melee weapons. Maybe that'll help increase my damage output. Is there anything that makes sense to start increasing? Like, the repair is absolute garbage. Gambling is one of those things where it's just like, I don't know. You could just quick save or whatever. I don't know. First aid, don't, melee weapons. I mean, kind of like the unarmed. And once I get like a power fist, it'll be really cool and fun, I think. But till then, we're just kind of eking out small damage. I'm going to save the points. I don't have to spend them. I think that's, I think that's a wise call. See about our next perk and everything, right? And thanks for helping out, Rebecca. It was a wonderful thing you did for a stranger. Okay. Well, I guess I haven't checked out the rest of this place yet, though. You know? I want to search everything before I go and talk to the guy that I'm supposed to talk to. These are the bathrooms with nothing in them. By the way, holding shift to see if there's anything to pick up. I see nothing. Okay, well, let's go talk to Zeke. Well, let's go search the rest of this building. And then I'll go talk to Zeke. I didn't really search the rest of this area too, area too thoroughly. There, the bodies are gone. Because, like, I can go in here, can't I? Isn't that... A door of sorts to a mine or something? Oh, that's the vault. That's right. I'm stupid. Can I use this on that? That does nothing. See a metal door. I don't... Oh, wow. I'm almost dead. Why don't we zed this? Wait. Escape. First aid was five, right? Fail to do any healing. All right, I got 25 XP for healing one hit point. Three hit points that time. Fail, fail. Another fail. One more, come on. One more. You got one more in you, don't you? Heal two hit points. 25 XP. Good enough, I guess. Rest until party is healed. Namely me. Because I keep getting zapped by a trap on a door that I can't open, apparently. But I probably don't want to go into the vault. That's where, uh... Darien and the cons are, or are, or whatever. So, we don't want to go in there quite yet. I guess we'll talk to Zeke. Wow. Wow. It's taken a while, but there we go. I'm healed. Everybody's healed. That's fantastic. That's a good quick save. All right, well, was there anything else in this building? Like a container of any kind? Any kind of loot when I hold shift? Does not look like it. Okay, well, we've searched this. Let's go talk to Zeke. And also, let's put that away. I don't really want to have it anymore. Okay, Zeke, 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 buddy. Feels like I should pop out right here, but it's okay. I'm not going to complain. Go open this door and talk to Zeke. The leader of the Vault 15 people. Rebecca has told me what you did for her. I want to apologize for the treatment you received here. You certainly didn't deserve it. What can I help you with? I've got some questions for you. What do you want to know? Do you work for Darian? Yes, I do. I act as a middleman between him and the people here. I'm not very happy about that fact now that I know what he's up to. I see. What do you intend to do about the raiders? Nothing. They have the guns, they control the water, and they control food. That means they are in charge, period. We have no skills and no means of support without backing the backing of Darian. How can we turn against him? We're at his mercy. Hmm, I see. I know where the vault entrance is. Let's see. Is there anything else going on around here? There's a city west of here called the NCR. They claim it Vault 15 is their ancestral home and they want it back. They've been sending people here to trying to talk to us into leaving, but we aren't going for it. This is the only home we know. Okay. 
I guess that's where the vault entrance is. It's behind that door over there, but it's locked from the other side and trapped, too. I don't have any means of opening it. Wait a minute. I found this key card some time ago. I have no idea what it's for. Rebecca says that you found some sort of door where they were holding Chrissy. Maybe this card will open it. Here, take it. Thanks. I'll try. I guess that's it. I'll be going now. All right. So he gave me what I needed. Quick save. You have searchables, though. So I'm going to search your searchables. How about your bookshelf? Empty bookshelves. The best bookshelves. Oh, you have a trap door, I see. That wasn't very nice of you. All right. Well, you probably got something cool. My favorite is in my way all the time. Okay. Well, I guess we go and try and check out the vault. I don't know if I am strong enough yet, but we'll we'll check it out. Cause I still got stuff to do. It'd be nice to have. It would be nice to have. What's his name? Marcus. Can I just use this for my inventory, please? I can. Okay. Well, let's see if this is just going to be instant death, or if we can kill some of these people and actually sell all their stuff, because that would be a big boom. Hello. What the? I don't think I know you. Who the hell are you? I got my ID right here. Let me show you. All right, wise ass. Take your best shot. Oh, I, I guess I pointed. I don't know. I wasn't armed. But if this is how it must be, this is how it must be. Move out of the way so I don't get shot. Sulik. Good shot. All right. That guy's eventually... These guys are coming, right? He used Mentats. And presumably to increase his perception, I'm assuming. Oh, yeah. Good night, lady. That's why I don't really want to be standing too close to these guys, I guess. But, oh, well. We'll do this. We'll punch him in the eyes. And then I think I'll kind of let my guys do some stuff and I'll move this way. Nice. He missed his kick. Ow. Ow. Kill that man, Sulik. Vic missed because he's super close right now. Lenny missed because he's Lenny. I'm going to my inventory. And I'm going to use one of my mini stim packs. And I'm going to use another one since I'm in here, right? Okay, now I'm pretty much full again. Let's punch this scary guy with that scary gun in the face. Right in the eyes. Maybe once more. With feeling. And then I die. I was hit for 79 hit points. That was fantastic. Alright, quick save. Establish this as our quick save. Yes. All right. Well, I don't know if we're up for this. I think we're going to want Marcus for it, maybe. Maybe. We'll see. I think it's time I try to get back to my car in Broken Hills. So let's just hit the Broken Hills button and get going. I will uncover some new stuff going this way. Why don't we have a stop somewhere? There's new Reno. Going through mountains should be slow travel. All right. Nice little stop to have a good heal. Am I, am I full? Yes. 56. Oops, I didn't even save. That was silly. Get over here. Hit my favorite button. And now back to Broken Hills. At least we're like halfway through it now. We got the car there, which is nice. I forgot I was going to... I don't have enough money, I don't think. But I was going to buy some... I think the NCR cells. The microfusion cells that I can put into the car. I think I'm going to let them run to me, to tell you the truth. Or they're all going to run to Sulik. 
Okay, well, good shots there. They did nice. Good job, Zulik. I mean, this is a waste of ammo, I'm pretty sure, but... Oh, wow. Zulik was hit for no damage. Okay, let's come up to this person. Switch over and give him one targeted shot in the eyes. And I guess just uh, kind of try to move into the thick of it. <clears throat> oh, dear. I forgot about the what happens in the thick of it. Luckily, I was not hit. Just two mantises left. Um, there you go. Good night. I guess I'll just take my turn. That didn't kill it. It was just eight points with all of those bullets. Maybe he's using, like, the wrong ones, like armor piercing or something, instead of, like, hollow points. I don't know. It's not my fault. Well, let's just get in... Yeah, we'll do this. Whatever. I was going to say get in three punches, but we can probably just kill it with this. And combat. And it was 420 XP. Nice. Oh, there's a cave. What's in the cave? Sometimes there's, you know, decent stuff. Or experience. No? Nothing in this cave? This is an empty cave. Okay. That's fine. F6. Sometimes you can go into those caves in random encounters. Jason, the village weakens. It is harder to touch your dreams. You must hurry, or we will all... Oh, dear. Well, I, I got the car so I can start hurrying. But, I, I, you know, yeah, you're right. I'm not in a terrible hurry, rush. Um, They were 420 XP last time and a lot of ammo. Maybe I just run from the mantises. I think I just run from the mantises. If we kill some, we kill some. Ideally, without having to use ammo. Well, there it is. Lenny, See, Lenny's on with me. He's just running away. Vic and Sulik, on the other hand. Oh, no. He took a shot. And he did a good shot there. Although it was a mistake. He, oops, Mantis was hit instead of Mantis. So it wasn't the Mantis he was aiming for. Look, guys. This is all great and everything. But let's just go ahead and leave. I think this is fine. I'm sure Sulik will live. Okay. Back to the trip to Broken Hills. Another encounter. Oh, no. This is a deadly encounter, I think. Well, let's see. Can I one-shot you? I think so. Not you, apparently. Run away. They're gonna, like, just surround me, though, and that tends to be trouble. Let's see what Sulit can do. If he should open up with a burst in this direction. To the right, hopefully. Yeah, this is gonna hurt. You didn't... Oh, dear. I was hit for no damage, at least, but... This could turn... Go south real quick, though. There's... Oh, you only got one with it. Darn it. I mean, a kill's a kill. These are a lot of dogs. Yeah, of course Vic missed at this range. With a scoped hunting rifle. Ooh. Yeah, the hit points are going down, that's for sure. I don't know if I can survive another round if I don't heal. Is Vic gonna survive? This looks like bad, bad news. This is feeling like bad, bad news. Okay, the one that's facing that way, kill it. And then, I don't know, this way. That only did four damage, four hit points of damage. See, now here's the thing. I don't know if I survive. I'll, tr I'll try. If I live to heal, I'll heal. Probably should have had a quick save at the last Mantis encounter. Dogs keep missing. Lenny has a ton of hit points. He should be fine. 
Vic, I'm a little worried about. Especially since they landed that crit on him. Okay, well, I'm able to do some stim packs, so I will. Three should be fine. And now I've got enough to punch two of these in the eyes. Or just kill one, I guess. Make sure I get the kill. The less dogs, the less damage. Alright, you actually hit it. Okay, just everyone stay alive. We're doing well. Stay alive. Stay alive. These dogs, they're relentless. They get so many bites. Okay. Let's hopefully I can kill the two by me. One shot them. Darn it. And you didn't die? I think the move is to still move. Otherwise, I think they get an extra attack in on me. So, move away a little bit. Yeah, now they only get two attacks. I think they can get three attacks when they're just standing next to you. I don't know, though. Let's see. No, they only seem to get two, so that really didn't matter. I should probably just go with the armor class in the future. Good to know. Okay, punch it in the eyes. Hopefully dies. It does. In the eyes, and it's dead. We've got two wolves, two wolves, two dogs left. One dog left. No dogs left. That was 780 XP. You know, I'll take it. Let's rest until the party is healed, though. I'm mostly good, but I think Vic took some heavy damage. I'm not certain, but I don't have awareness. I could go and check in his... What you may call it? If I talk to him in the combat, whatnot. But I think I still need awareness to just have it look at him and know his health. Come on. Who's got the. It's, Vic's probably got the slow healing rate. And there was some non zero damage done to Lenny, who has 100 plus hit points or whatnot, so. That's actually plenty of resting, please. Please. You don't understand. It's plenty. Okay, F6, and we're almost there. Broken Hills. And we don't need to go that far into it. Go there. Works the same. Oh, dear. Well, this is sort of an encounter I wanted, but not really. A band of rogues. There's five of them. There's only four of us. Six of them. I'm sorry. Seven. Seven of them. I will... Wow, that's a long way away. I think I try to run. Hopefully they're all targeting me to start and they need to run closer. No, Sulik. Okay, well. If they're all still gonna like target me, come on now. Don't shoot Vic. Oh, she's got quite the gun. I don't think we have any chance in hell of making it out of here without a companion dying. Oh dear. Yeah, that, that, Vic was hit for 40 points. I think Vic's gonna die before, oh, Sulik is about to die. He's almost dead. And I've got a long way away. Well, this looks like we're just going to go ahead and bite the bullet on this one. And I shouldn't have moved. I should have just quick loaded. Because Vic's going to die and Suluk's going to die. There went Vic. And there went Suluk. Okay, we'll try this again. Leaving the dogs. Let's just try and get halfway between us and Broken Hills. 
More dogs. More dogs. Oh no. I think I'm already blocked in, so I need to kill something to move. And I didn't. Alright. Take my turn. I can't even run away because I just spawned trapped. But I am surrounded. I think. Vic is taking up a spot, possibly Lenny, where I can't get a they can't get a full surround on me. Really hoping those burst fires would take out more than one animal. Ouch. Now that I'm on the ground, that's bad news. Now you've got me pissed off. Vic missed because he's got a, like essentially a sniper rifle and he's right up close with people. I guess I should actually give him the sniper rifle. I think it runs on the same ammo. Runs on the same ammo? You know what I mean. Okay. In the eyes. Are you kidding me? Now it's dead. Now... They continue to bite me. I'm going to have to use stim packs here if I can. It's a big if. And I have enough stim packs. I should start giving at least one or two to my companions so they can heal. Okay. Here we go. Stim packs. Use them. Second one. 45 should be hopefully good enough to finish these dogs off. Oh dear, I wanted this. I mean... I critically hit him, but he didn't die. Is Suluk officially out of ammo now? Great. That's fantastic. Yep, yep, I, I have the same sentiment. Everybody at least just survive. I mean, I have stim packs, so in theory I should survive. But, punch him in the eyes. One shot, okay. Okay. Darn it, I didn't one shot him. Get out of there, a little bit. Yeah, Sulik is officially out of ammo. Oh dear. This could be a lot of stim packs for just dogs. I guess the last dogs gave me like 700 XP though, right? Provided they don't kill my friends. Which is far from a given at this point. Yes, run away, Vic. You are very intelligent. Run away. I'm trapped once again. Punch you in the eyes. Punch you in the eyes. Try to run away. Oh, I should have healed. Oh, well. I might die. <laughs> Hopefully the other dogs can only... Oh, I was hoping they can only get one hit in with their action point movement. I was killed. Rest in peace, chosen one. Beautiful. Load game. We're going to get there. We're going to get there. You believe believe you me. Yes, of course. Okay. How about to here? I forget that I have it on hard, so this is again obnoxious. Maybe hard is just not the way to play this game when you're unarmed. Let's see. I set myself up to fail, I think. Okay. Oh, I didn't kill it. And just knocked it to the ground. Oh, okay, I take my turn. This is fun. This is all of the fun. Have you guys, uh, have you guys played Fallout 2 on hard? What do you guys think? Maybe I should lower the difficulty? What do you guys think? Because I really want to play unarmed. It just sounds like fun to me, but 
it's a little tough to get going, you know what I mean? I mean, Lenny's only strength is that he has a lot of hit points. I think I'm going to try and get out of this encounter if I can. We'll see. Someone's bound to die. I got ribs. Okay. Dog was killed. Sulik getting hit. Can I run? I hope I'm not surrounded. I am surrounded. I was really hoping for the other, actually. Kill it. Ugh. I think we might die here. Because I can't even run. I start, like, spawned in like this. I might even just quick load here. We'll see. It's just... It's just... Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> I guess so. I don't know. Either way, we can... Once this is done, I'm just going to quick load. That's a bleeder. Yep, that's right. I'm pretty much done with the dogs, to tell you the truth. So, let's do this. And a little bit shorter sights in mind. Well, still, I want to get up here. Come on, let's go. Go there. Can you make it? No encounter. All right, all right, all right. And we're a lot closer now. Now just make it to Broken Hills without dying is the goal. Oh, dear. It's always the dogs. It's always the dogs. Can I run at least? Yes, I can. Okay, so which way is running? I think down might be the closest. We'll go to the right. I think it's about equidistant. That was, you know, I, I tried to use the, the word properly and I didn't. So, we'll just forget that. Pretend I said something intelligent. You just have to pretend most of the time. Okay. Guys, we don't want to fight these dogs. We don't want to fight these dogs at all. And I like the car because it's something that you're right next to that you can go and exit the fight with, usually. Oh, I think you broke a rib. I mean, they've killed some dogs. Or at least one I saw. Do not surround me. Not allowed to surround me. Those are rules. Rules of engagement that I have just declared. No surroundies. Wow. Okay. So that's that's one dog killed, it sounded like. Yep. One dog was killed. We still got all three of our companions alive. I mean, if Lenny died, I just want to get his gun off of him. That's about it. I don't really care. He's not going to start. He's not going to have a restart because of Lenny. All right. Sulik. Maybe Sulik goes back to being melee with me or something. Yeah, we give him something nice melee. Give him his knife back or something. I don't know. No? Big missed. Okay. I can totally get out of here. Let's do it. Alright. Broken Hills. How about that? I'm gonna go... Ugh, downtown. Just got a spasm in my leg. Ah, okay. Either way, that's a great way to end this video. Uh, until next time, everyone, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, comment. Take care.